Hello YouTube, what is up? It's Ghost Squad 57 here, and today I'm going to be doing a gameplay and commentary of Haunt for Linux. Now, Haunt is a first-person survival horror game uh, made in the Unity 3D engine. If you've ever played Slenderman, it's it's really s the same thing as that kind of. I mean, there are definitely differences. Like this game has better graphics uh one thing and uh yeah before i get started i'd like to mention that i am running this on the debian testing which is now jesse because wheezy was released uh, about a while back i'm not too sure how long but uh yeah it runs perfectly well on my system uh i should mention that i am running a intel i5 3550 and a Radian HD 5750. I just want to get all my hardware out of the way so that way, you know, I don't have to deal with it in the comments. But uh, yeah, it, the, the title screen sort of bugs out. I don't know if this is intentional or not, but it's just sort of this weird flickering and stuff. It almost looks like it's an effect, so I don't know if it's like graphics or just the game in general. Uh, yeah, it actually took me a while to find the options, too, because you have to move your mouse over here from the pop-up, and I think this is Swedish here, so I had no idea what the hell any of these things here said. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and start the game. Now you have difficulty here. Uh, noob. Infinite flashlight. Flashlight. Uh, marker small, slender... Gamer. I think I'll pick Gamer. Yeah, sure. I did play this game a little bit, but uh, not very much. I just remember walking in a corridor, getting lost, and then just exiting the game and never playing it. <laughs> but yeah, hopefully we can get pretty far today. Uh, this is more of a first impressions video. I just want to make that clear. So if it seems like I ramble or mumble for a bit, it's because uh, I really haven't played the game much, and it's sh I'm just talking about like my first uh, like instinct when I play the game. Anyway, yeah, let's, let's get the controls here. WASD moves. Uh, I don't think I can crouch. I'm hitting control and C. Nothing's happening. F is flashlight. I saw that coming. Weird though, the flashlight just sort of turns on. Like you see the hand animation, he doesn't actually click on the button or anything, it just sort of comes on, but whatever. You can sprint with shift, although the camera sort of shakes a little bit when you do that. Um, Alright. I always thought the textures looked a little weird. The thing just sort of has a glossy look to it, but I guess because it's raining. Alright, it's a truck here. You, somebody should be near. Oh, I didn't. I didn't get to read that. Uh, anyway, this must be my map, of some sorts. All right, I'm hitting M, and there's no map, so I guess I'm supposed to use this. Uh, this is death. Huh? Ah, that's probably where we gotta go. It's a clipboard here. Yeah. So, uh, in Cylinder Man, you find these notes on trees, and here you find these little like uh, notes as well, but they're scattered more methodically, you know what I mean? They're not just taped to a tree. There's batteries there, too. I don't know if you could see them or not. But yeah, the game gives you a little bit of backstory as to what's going on, which is nice. Uh, tab. I was looking for the key that closed it. It's tab. That closes and opens it. Well, I kind, of, I kind of think that's cool, how you get a first-person view of the notes and all that. That's, that's, that's really cool. I like that. Let's open this gate. Gate sort of has a weird glow to it, but I guess that's so you know you can open it. Oh, whoa, what the? I think I just missed something. <laughs> now that I think about it, I think that happened last time I played too, but last time I just sort of like looked behind me like, what the hell was that? Alright, so there's two paths here. Um, I don't remember which way led to death, but I think it's on the right side, so I'm just gonna go right. It's usually when the game says, Death. It usually means that's where you gotta go, so I'm just gonna take some initiative here. What the hell? What the fuck? Screen got a bit blurry there. Or fuzzy. Hmm. I don't know if that 
that little bit of fuzziness there was like uh, predetermined or if it was just sort of a monster actually coming up on me. Anyway, death is this way, so I'm gonna keep going this way. I think if you turn your flashlight off, he doesn't see you or something like that, so I'm gonna try that. Oop, lightning scared me a little bit. So yeah, the graphics are definitely better than the uh, first Slender game. I mean, the first Slender game kind of looked like... The colors kind of look like they were done with MS Paint, but at the same time, you know, it's just, it was just a small game. Grass is very, like, uh, weird. It's sort of, all the grass moves in the same direction. Whoa! Okay, that's scary. Okay, I'm gonna get the hell out of here. Yeah, the, yeah, the grass is weird in the way it moves, because it all moves in the same direction, and it sort of goes back and forth like that. It's very weird. So death is that way. Uh, do I want to keep going? Ah, uh, screw it. I've already gone this far. Oh, this looks horror. Oh, this looks terrifying. Oh, God. Just one long, huge, like, area. Oh, man. Oh. Uh, there's a fork. Ah, uh, go right. Just going right hasn't failed me yet. Yeah, like I said, I have no idea where I'm going. All I know is that I'm supposed to collect uh, scraps. Okay, I'm gonna go look over here for some. Again, I can't crouch, which kind of sucks because I would like to crouch under that bus and look, but I don't know. Doesn't seem like there's anything here. Whoa, whoa! What the fudge pack and Frank was that? What the hell? Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, I am getting a little bit scared. But again, I don't know if all that's like, uh... Predetermined if all these sights I'm seeing are, if it's natural. Alright, it's a typewriter. Is this a save point? Oh, that's awesome. I like that. I like typewriters being save points. It reminds me of uh, Resident Evil. I think it's very cool when games do that. There's a gate here. Hmm. Oh, there's nothing over there. I'm not going to fall for that. Uh, I don't know how to open that. Here was a switch or something. That's a gate there, too. Mm. First puzzle. Damn, I hope I didn't go the wrong way all this time. Uh, I'm just gonna look around, see if there's any switches or something. So I haven't, I did not go this route last time. Uh, let's go over here. Oop! That's some loud lightning. I am probably sprinting too much. My character's making is panting heavily, so I think I might be like tiring tiring him out. Is this a dead end? Oh my god, this is like bait right here. It's just nothing but a dead end. Oh, if the monster spawns there, that's so cheap. Oh, and I can't lean. Oh, that's terrible. So if I follow that trail to the dead end and then the monster spawns behind me, I'm screwed. Oh man, I think I went the wrong way. Oh, this sucks. Oh, I don't want to run all the way back there. Typewriter! Tell me what to do. There's a switch or something I'm missing. That's what it is. Nope, screw it. I'm just gonna go the other way and see where I, see what I can find. 
Very disappointing to come all this way and find out that all the gates are locked. And, oh, character seems to be bobbing up and down. I think it's because I've been sprinting for too long. The environment's very wide open, I like that. Ooh, the sky looks a little fuzzy. Ugh. Oh, what the hell was that? Alright, map! Alright. Uh, there's some sort of... Something up there, so let's go see what it is! There's a a random fence here. Oh, it's a broken fence? Oh, okay, this is a house or something up here. I see a light. That's a statue. It's a statue of a woman with a glowing vagina, it seems. I'm gonna text that something, but I missed it. What is this? Scrap! All operations have ended except... <laughs> I can't believe I screwed that word up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, that's cheap. I'm not even going to read that. That's cheap. Okay. What the hell? Is he on? Is is the damn enemy following me or what? I have no idea now. What is this? Map. Okay, this way. I should be looking behind me. I'm still gonna do it though. Uh, I should have looked at that map. I should. Okay, I'm gonna go back. I, God, I'm starting to panic. Uh, okay, I'm just gonna go around in a circle, I suppose. Just keep going this way. Oh, that damn light! Whoa, it's like a tower over there. Oh, whoa! What the hell? like a tower or something over here. There's a fence. There's probably an opening or something somewhere. Oh man, this tall grass is creepy because he could be anywhere and I couldn't even see him. Whoa, whoa, what the hell? What, where is he? Oh, shit. Alright. Whew. Oh, okay. That got me. Alright, that's not Slenderman. I have no idea what the hell that is. Whew. Alright. <laughs> Alright. Alright, well, <laughs> that's the end of my uh, little let's play of Haunt. Uh, let me know what you guys thought in the comments. Uh, I might continue playing this game if enough people think I should. Uh, it seems like a short game. Uh, anyway, Ghost Squad 57 signing out.